What's up guys, welcome to the Kuna video, and um, when I took a walk at night, you guys said you thought the video was cool, and I said uh, I'm going to take a walk video like other times, um, throughout like different weather and shit, so I'm doing that, so today, um, it's raining like a bitch currently, and when I was going to go take a walk, um, I'm gonna try to see if I can get lightning in the sky. Like, I've been seeing a lot of lightning. I always fucking miss it. But anyway, when I was trying to take my walk, my dad, he was all like, Oh, you sure you want to go outside? It's raining. I'm like, what do you the fuck I look like? The Wicked Witch of the West? The Wizard of Oz? You think I'm gonna melt if I go outside? Like, chill out. <laughs> um, I might as well tell you guys a shorter little story that um, happened to me yesterday. Um... Well, I was fucking, I was waiting for one of my friends, one of my friends just was hanging out for a little while, so, um, his phone was all being stupid, and, um, like, all his messages weren't going through, so it was just like, oh, just meet me, blank, and it just, like, cut off, so I was like, okay, I'll just fucking wait by his house, because I don't know where to go, so I waited by his house for about a solid 30 minutes, I'd say, and I mean, I don't fucking mind waiting, I don't care. Um, I would say I was doing that, and, and I was waiting there for about five minutes at first, and then one of my friends called me up, and he was just like, oh, what are you doing? Uh, I go, I'm just, um, I'm just chilling by this fucking tree, um, <laughs> me and my friend the tree, I was just over there chilling by the tree, just waiting, and then like halfway into, um, me talking to Talking to a friend just about random bullshit as as we do. Um, this old man, this fat old man that looked like fucking like Winnie the Pooh, he walked up to me and said, Excuse me, young man, uh, do you think you could help me with something? And I was like, uh, I guess, depends what it is. I'm not fucking washing your back because you can't reach or something, Grandpa. I didn't really say that, but I just said it depends what you want help with. And he said, oh, well, uh, my dog is lost, and um, I want you to get in my car and help me find it. And I was like, I, I just, I knew something was bad, so I just, I just said, I was just like, nah. I said it just like that, just like, oh, uh, I was just like, nah. He was like, oh, are you sure you don't want to help? And I was, he was like, I do me a big, great deal. And I was like, nah, I'm good. I'm good, man. I'm good. <laughs> he was just like, okay. <laughs> I guess you got fucking what have gotten you point in heaven. And I'm like, yeah, you're not you're not touching that PP today, mister. So the lesson of that story is if some creepy old motherfucker comes up to you and is like, oh, I wish I think got carried in my van. And fucking run away. <laughs> I was telling one of my other friends about that on Instagram. I'm like, oh, some more experience happened to me when I was nine. And I was like, well, you too. And uh, uh, they said, they said they were like, oh, and I was walking down the street. And this one dude, he was just like, hey, I got some candy in my van. You want, you want to have some of my candy? And the person was like, Nah, they just walked away. I don't know if they said nah, but they told me they just ran away. So, I think that's the logical thing to do. And, um, I was lucky that I was on the phone, because, I mean, like, one of the things I said, I was like, oh, I'm kind of busy, I'm on the phone right now with someone very important, even though it was just one of my friends, and, I mean, it wasn't, like, some crazy important call, like... Like a call I'd never be able to get again. I mean, like, and the guy was just like, "Oh, are you sure?" And that's that's when I said, "Nah," you know. And I thought that was kind of funny. But anyways, um, he was like, we're inside the game, like L.A. Noir right now. You ever played that? Just because the way it's like raining and shit. Um, but I'll probably end up putting some. Oh, there's some lightning. I'll probably end up putting some L.A. Noir music behind it. Um, this is what I'll probably do. These car lights look weird, like a weird little glare. Um, and stuff. And another thing that happened to me today when I was on, um, like sometimes I'll take two walks, so I'll take, 
sometimes a shorter one during the day or a longer one during the day and, like, and um, depending what I'll do like if I take a shorter one during the day I'll take a longer one during the night and if I take a longer one during the night I'm going to take a shorter one in the day or sometimes I just end up going for like one walk like one really long walk sometimes I just oh shit there's some more right now then I ended up doing that like yesterday I just went for a really long walk I went um, I don't know let me see I think I went out around 2.30 and then I came back around 8.30 so yeah sometimes I'll just take long ass walks and shit um, so anyways um, I almost forgot what I was talking about but what I was saying was I was just um, standing in the Culver's parking lot. I think I was trying to text back somebody, and this fucking dude, he just honked his horn at me. And he was like, get out of the way. And I was like, I was like, nah. I just ended up saying that because I thought it was funny. Like, after uh, what had happened the other day, I just keep just saying that. It's like, I said that in the story to my mom, the way I said it, she just thought it was kind of funny. So now I'm just going to, like, respond to that with everything. My mom just, like, take out the dishes. I'm like... Nah, I don't wanna. <laughs> I fucking just turned into a ninja turtle there. Fucking pizza! <laughs> one thing that I thought was really funny was on Instagram, there was this one meme I saw where it was, um, like it was an obviously like an anti drug um, PSA thing. And like, you know, fucking kids are stupid, so they just listen to every character. Like on cartoons, like if SpongeBob's like, hey kids, fucking smoke crack, do it, it's cool. And then you just be like, oh well, well, SpongeBob told me to do it, so it's cool, but really don't actually smoke crack, it's bad. <laughs> but one thing that I thought was funny about that was uh, the poster. Um, it said, it said, say no to drugs, say yes to pizza, which was like just the thing they would show like elementary kids, so they'd be like, uh, diabetes is better than fucking a nicotine buzz. Just kidding. I don't even like nicotine. I've never even tried it. <laughs> but anyway, um, the thing is, like, I just keep getting sidetracked. The thing is, um, the meme, what it, um, changed to, it said, say no to yes. No, it said, um, yeah, it said, say no to yes, say pizza to drugs. That was a big burp. It said, say no to yes, say pizza to drugs. Hold on, I gotta fucking spit on the ground there. It said, like, say no to yes, say pizza to drugs, is what I was saying. So it just makes me think of, like, some dude in an alleyway. It's just like, hey kid, you want some fucking cocaine? And then some kid's just like, pizza! <laughs> pizza! That's what it makes me think of. And... I think it's funny, um, one thing that's pretty stupid with the Shell gas station over here is, um, they don't know how the law works, apparently. Because one of my, um, friends had told me, they were like, oh, my dad wanted me to get him a lighter for 4th of July, and I couldn't, and I was like, what do you mean? And, um, the mobile gas, not the mobile gas station, sorry, the Shell gas station, um, he said he was going to go there and to buy a lighter in all 50 states you can look it up you have to be 18 not fucking 35 not 21 not fucking 902 none of that shit you have to be 18 years old with proof of an ID so like the guy he goes in there and he buys a fucking he tries to buy a fucking lighter and the dude says show me your ID he shows it to him and he goes you got to be 21 He's like, no, you don't. You only have to be 21 to fucking buy alcohol and all that other shit. So the guy was like, no, it's 21. He's like, no, it's 18. So then my friend, he literally pulls up the law. Like, you can fucking go to Chrome or fucking um, Opera or fucking AOL, Internet Explorer, whatever browsers you want to fucking use. And Google, and, and Google in there, what is the age to buy a lighter? in fucking America. And it will say 18 years old, like throughout all 50 states. And the dude was even showing him, and the guy was like, no, no, no. It's fucking like Photoshop or whatever. <laughs> like, 
Photoshop. What the fuck do you mean it's Photoshop? It's on Google. What's that even supposed to mean? Let's see if we can get some lightning over here. Um, I think every time I just like point the camera away. Um, I you always get some. Hey, because that was funny a while ago, like fucking two weeks ago or something. I was also on a walk, and, um, like, it was also, there's a lot of lightning, too, basically, like, a similar storm like this or whatever, and I was like, hmm, maybe I can get some cool shots of lightning or whatever, and, like, I literally stood just, like, pointing my fucking camera at the sky for literally, like, five whole minutes, and I was just like, oh, come on, I gotta get that cool lightning shot, and then I couldn't end up getting it. Okay, I'm walking now. Couldn't end up getting any pictures because I mean, like the second I would point my camera back down, like I would like point it up and I point it back down. Like the second I would do that, fucking like ten million fucking streaks of lightning would go across the sky. That also reminds me of another great little shorter story time. Some of the story times, like things that happened there. I don't tell on the channel, not because they're not good stories, just because, like, they don't deserve their own videos, like, they deserve to be, like, little fucking segments of me just talking for 20 minutes or whatever on these videos, so you don't just hear fucking cars whooshing and, like, some dude fucking shaking the camera while walking, you know, but, um, anyways, about what happened about two weeks ago or so, was I was taking a walk, and I, uh, I didn't have to be home till about... 9.30 or so, but I had to come back at 9, because I was getting a horrible headache, and so I popped two Advils, fucking laid myself in bed, and, like, over a period of time, like, um, like, what Advil does is, like, you eat it, and then it, um, just goes into your body, dissolves, the pill dissolves, and then whatever fucking, um, I don't even know, whatever type of fucking pain reliever they got inside of those bitches goes inside your body to like where the pain is and it like gets rid of the pain like um so it did that for me and I was just laying in bed trying to fall asleep and it always takes like 30 or so minutes to kick in I don't know if he's fucking counted I'm not just sitting there with a the fucking like stopwatch and like fucking like oh for Jimmy Adderall not Adderall <laughs> I'm stupid not, I just like fucking doing experiments, I'm like, oh, for Billy, Advil takes 30 minutes to kick in, oh, but for, for Jimmy, it takes 32 minutes to kick in, oh my god, I fucking, I don't know what I'm talking about, anyway, just saying, like, I popped the Advil, got in bed, I just, um, got watching some YouTube, I don't remember what I was doing, I was just trying to get rid of the pain so I could... Just do something to buy the time, get my mind off it, and give her the pain so I could go to sleep and take my fucking, have, have a dream about a big titty golf girl or something, I don't know. But anyway, I would just go, I'd just be going to bed, trying to fall asleep, and then at about 10 o'clock or so, um, I don't even know how this happened, like my door, my uh, bedroom door, like even though it was locked, it literally opened by itself, and I thought it was my brother, so I ended up saying, I was like, Kyle, is that you? And he didn't say anything, the door was closed, so I was like, all right, fuck this. So I ended up getting out of bed, and I'm like, and I go, and I look for my brother, and he's downstairs playing Minecraft, and it would be like literally impossible for him to... Um, go all the way from my room and then downstairs to play Minecraft within like five seconds. He's not a Lamborghini. You can't go from zero to 60 in three seconds. So I was just like, what the hell? And I asked him, I'm like, why'd you open my door? And he's like, I didn't open your door. And I was just like, what the hell? So then I asked my dad, I was like, dad, did you open my door? He's like, no, I've been sleeping. And it wasn't my mom because she wasn't even home yet. So I just asked him. And I still don't know what even happened, and my parents were like, oh, it's probably just a dream. But I think it was some type of ghost or something. Because, uh, like a similar experience I had a while ago, 
that's um, uh, some experience I had a while ago that um, I think also was sort of a ghost. I didn't see any fucking, like, entities of fucking Big Bird or something. Didn't see any of that shit. But I was just laying down watching YouTube my Chromebook, which is, like, back when I had my Chromebook, so this is probably, like, two years ago or something. Um, these are, like, these experiences, like, happen pretty few and far between, like, like, up until, um, like, before the door, um, time, I literally, before the day that, um, my door opened, like, the fucking, like, their experience was, like, two years ago, and so it's not like it's, it's not like it's every other night, and fucking the demons are just, like, it's party time, fucking casual Sunday or whatever, nothing like that, um, it was just weird because I was in my, uh, I was saying I was in my Chromebook, right, and I was able to actually, like, take it and pick it up and put it on the floor so I could lie down and watch videos if I wanted. I can't do that with my big-ass laptop now because it's, like, two pounds, and, like, I think a Chromebook weighs, like, half a pound, so it was a lot easier to, and I was just watching YouTube, and it felt like there was, and it felt like something was, like, blowing on the back of my neck. So weird. So I looked around, I was like, is my window open? And it wasn't. I just fucking farted. I think it's my window open, no it isn't. I checked and I was like, is my, uh, is my fan on? Uh, like I have just like a little, like, um, tiny fan. It's not one of those big box fans. It's a little tiny fan and I was like, is this fan on? And it wasn't. So I thought that was pretty crazy. Um, because I'm not sure what happened. Like, I never had explanations for those. Um, it's pretty weird, to be honest. So, the video is about getting to be pretty long. Because usually my camera will end it after, like, 18 minutes of consecutive footage. <clears throat> Just does that by itself. It runs out of memory or some shit. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I uh, hope you have a very good day or night. I'll see you guys very soon.